Kasan. How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Right now it's springtime, middle of spring, and uh, my last video that I posted was a white fish, ice fishing, catch, clean, cook video. It has been a while since I've been able to bring you uh, videos because work and stuff has been busy. Uh, needless to say, today will not be an ice fishing adventure. It will be, um, well, I don't know if you can tell, but those red straps, that's when I have the kayak on top of the roof. And yes, I'm going to take the kayak out for my first kayak outing of the year. And uh, this time of the year, um, not many fish are open, but I am going to go for some pan fish uh, to start the spring off. Hopefully it'll be successful. Today's temperatures, right now it's not very warm. It's like three degrees Celsius. Supposed to jump up to eight degrees. Uh, kind of cold. I hope it's not going to be too bad. Hopefully, hopefully, we'll be on some fish. I'll be hitting some of the Kawartha lakes today, one of the Kawartha lakes today, and we'll see if there's going to be a good action. As I said, uh, my previous video was a white fish catch, clean, and cook video. And uh, during that trip, I actually hired a guy. His name is Matt from. Uh, outdoor junkies and he's a really knowledgeable guy on the lake and that video which I'll link down below apparently sparked some controversy because well I use a guide but a majority of the videos uh, it's solo missions by myself where I've done a lot of research um, before going to those places and I really don't understand what the outrage is a lot of the pros Bob Zumi um, a lot of the other fishing um, channels, uh, Ty's Pig Patrol, a very well-known YouTuber, also uses guides, and it's obvious they go to Mexico and things like this, which you know they have no knowledge of that body of water. So I really don't understand what the outrage is of using guides for, like a minority of your videos. Anyway, today uh, is a very interesting location. I actually scouted this location um, from other people's YouTube videos. And uh, actually, to be specific, it's uh, one of the uh, videos from the 90s, one of the Canadian fishing shows. If I'm right, um, I should be on some fish. Um, there weren't a lot of clues in that video, but I think I've picked out enough that um, will help me locate where, um, where they targeted the panfish, and hopefully I'll be uh, in on some today. Man, it's a windy, cold one. I don't know if it's a good decision to come out, but we'll see what happens. Ice fishing jig head and a float and a little piece of uh, split shot and then uh, we're just gonna dangle it in the middle of the water column see if anything will bite oh, I still got the price tag there <laughs> So far, no bites. 
I just tipped the white plastic with a little bit of shrimp, see if that'll help. Right now the temperatures are still quite cold, like three degrees, four degrees, so the thinking is that uh, the fish will come in to some shallow areas. Right now I'm about two feet of water. See if that will, because uh, it's warmer here, it warms up quicker. See if that will get the fish to bite. The theory is that they'll come into the warmer places to start feeding. Six bites here, but I didn't set the hook. Must be small fish. We got a fish after a long time not getting a fish. Pumpkin seed, second species of the day. Pumpkin seed. Pumpkin seed, yeah. It's all these things, it's all these little panfish. You missing hook sets too? Yeah. So They're small. small. Yeah. Third species of the day is a uh, yellow perch. Third species. Yellow perch. Fourth fish of the day. You get trophy, eh? Let's mount it. Yeah. Double. <laughs>
fish today. None of them huge. What do we have here? It's still not a crap. <sighs> what is this? I'm not quite sure what this is. Could be a pumpkin seed, a bluegill, a hybrid. Not sure. Just got retied and got into a pretty decent size pumpkin seed. Got some. Another pumpkin seed. It's all pumpkin seed here. It's been hooked before this one. of the day. Pumpkin seed. So today's uh, pan fish fishing expedition was, you know, okay. Couldn't uh, land the species that I really wanted to land, which was the crappie, but we were able to get into many, many little fish. There were a lot of tiny bites that I was not able to hook up with, but mm, the uh, shallow waters is teeming with um, with panfish over here, so at least we got some action. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the video and I hope to bring you more content in the not too distant future. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you later.